Welcome to Hamped Up. Y'all ready for this? Last Friday, the Northampton boys basketball team opened their season at the Curry Hicks Cage over at UMass with a game against their rivals, Amherst. I sat down with Will O'Connor and Elijah Davis to talk about the upcoming season. All right, welcome guys. First week of winter sports, and the first question I think that's on everyone's mind is what happened to your nose? All right, so last week we had our first scrimmage. About two trips in, I went into the lane to get the ball and went face to chin with a kid on the other team. I looked down and then I realized my hands were filled with blood and I ran off the court, looked in the mirror and I was like, I've got to go to the hospital now. So your first game you played Amherst and you kept it close right up until the end of the fourth quarter and then that kid who can dunk and block and he kind of took over. But then next game you come back and you win in double overtime. So what adjustments did you make between the first and second game? Harp just stressed after the Amherst game that we need to finish. Like we hung with them the whole three quarters, three and a half, and then towards the end we kind of fell apart. So after that game and the next day in practice, he stressed, he stressed that we just got to finish. And I think against Aguam, double OT, we, we did that. So that was the first game. You guys obviously did very well right up until the end. So do you think by the end of the season that's a team you'll be able to compete with? Yeah, we had a bunch of young kids on the team. They, that was definitely their first time playing in the varsity atmosphere. They were nervous. Everyone was nervous. By the end of the season, we'll have that connection. So last season, I think the football team and the basketball team tied for a number of wins. And this year, the football team obviously upped the ante. You got to the playoffs. You won eight games. So is the basketball team going to exceed that this year, do you think? Yeah, definitely. I think our goal right now is to get to 10 so we uh, make the playoffs and then go from there. But yeah, I think we'll definitely exceed that. Yeah, we try to forget about last year. <laughs> yeah. So, and then my final question is, so the football games, obviously there's a big student section for both basketball and football, but I think for basketball it's a little more loud and intense because you're in a much smaller environment. So do you think that motivates you more than the student section at the football games because it's so much louder? I think just it's closer, um, so people are more interested, I guess. Um, but yeah, it definitely motivates me at least more than football. Yeah, basketball is a lot more up close and personal. And during the football games, I personally don't hear the fan section much. I tend to like tone it out. All right, great. Well, thank you guys so much for being here and good luck the rest of the season. Thank you, Connor. Thank you, Connor. We love basketball! In other sports news, the girls basketball team won their home opener against Pittsfield on Wednesday, 54 to 51. They are 2-0 to start the season. The swim team is also 2-0. The boys and girls track teams are off to a fast start. The boys are 3-0 and the girls are 2-1. Finally, the East Hampton ice hockey team, which features a number of players from Northampton High School, is off to an 0-2 start after dropping a couple of close games.